In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Before our reflection, I want to remind us that we are still having um, confessions, adoration, and now the privilege of communion on Fridays, um, as we've been doing. Uh, it's an opportunity for you to come, to renew yourself, and to spend time with Jesus uh, in the Blessed Sacrament. And thus, I want to remind you that Father Barry is still doing the day-to-day -day, uh, reflections on St. Joseph, and you can find this on the same website. This is the Daily Word of Friday, the 16th of April, 2021, of the second week of Easter. Let us pray. O oh God, hope and light of the sincere, we humbly entreat you to dispose our hearts, to offer you worthy prayer, and ever to extol you by dutiful proclamation of your praise. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, and our brother, who lives and reigns within the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. A reading from the Acts of the Apostles. A Pharisee in the Sanhedrin named Gamaliel, a teacher of the law, respected by all the people, stood up, ordered the apostles to be put outside for a short time, and said to the Sanhedrin, So now I tell you, have nothing to do with these men, and let them go. For if this endeavor or this activity is of human origin, it will destroy itself. But if it comes from God, you will not be able to destroy them, and you may even find yourselves fighting against God. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. The voice of wisdom is always needed in a group. Because as human beings, we can get all caught up in our emotions, and emotions can be very powerful. We can feel very strongly about things, only to find out that we feel very strongly um, about something on the wrong side of events. So when the emotions are high and raging, it is always important to have someone who is the voice of wisdom, one able to overcome the raging emotions and to be able to look beyond that moment into consequences. This is what we find in Gamaliel. He said he was a teacher of the law, respected by the people. He was the one who said, everything that does not have its origin in God, does not last. He says, anything that is ordained by God lasts. And if you fight it, you fight God. And so, in our own lives, we need to discern the moments, times, and seasons. We need to pray, ask God, listen, hear from God before we take sides on things. Most of life will be easier. We'll even be cool if we have people like Amalia. May God help us with discerning spirit. <laughs> 